So, Metal Rain 300's come by to show me another one of his builds. This is the Olympus. Uh, so we're going to have a look for a quick round the outside. It's so got a lot of detail on here. Hang on, let's have a look at this. I love it. A little bit of pixel art. Rockets. Hang on, let's see if we can figure out what this is. Looks like rockets. Lots of different rocket engines and things. And a sun. I did something like this in my uh, faction HQ. So I like it. That's really cool. So we've got a bit of pixel art down the side. He's made the uh, scaffolding look a bit tougher. Uh, so he's all banded and stuff. He's got these coming off the front again. I like that solar panel design. That looks... Oh, wait. That look, I know there might not be solar panels, but that looks epic. So it's two crystals and a wedge. That looks really nice. I'm going to be... Uh, going to borrow that, that design from you, mate, because that looks really nice and then we check out the gun and he's got the uh, banding like the clamps I use on my solar sailor which is kind of cool I love that obviously you'll see it in many places but um, yeah awesome okay he's really gone for the big space gun uh, right first things first let's have a look around the inside Okay, so here we are at the airlock. As you can see, this is roughly where I'm at. Okay, I'm going to hit the gravity. Let's check it out. It's a warship, so it only has two rooms. Let's see what this room is. There's a ship core, and I guess that's the view screen and weapons computer. So yeah, main deck. Cool. What's this? Oh, sweet. Epic core rooms. I love his core rooms. This guy makes great core rooms. It kind of feels like we were going to walk out into that uh, Cerebro from X-Men. <laughs> And then there wasn't a really big open room. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> Let's have another quick look at this area of the ship. Beautiful. Beautiful little ship. Well, it's not little at all. Beautiful ship. I don't know what this is all about. It's a cool idea he's got, but I'd love to know what it is. Are they, what are they? What are these? Okay, so he's telling me that there's shields inside here. So that's what they are. <laughs> so they're functional. <laughs> it's cool. They're the shield generators. I like it. I'm guessing he's got more than that hidden in there. But still, you know, he's thought to make a functional shield generator um, array, I guess would be the kind. There's lots of arrays in this. <laughs> so anyway, the grey lines he's saying are to mark out where the hardened hull is inside, protecting the core. So, there you go. Okay, so he's given it one click. So let's have a look at this then. So he's got a nice little space shotgun design. So he's taken out quite a lot of damage going back. So I think it's an improvement on his last one. Okay, so let's count that. So that's... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 26. So, one second. One second does half the uh, half of it. <laughs> that was really good. One second, 100. All right, and here we go.
he's through okay so he's shot through the core this is the uh, pattern that we've ended up with off of this weapon as you can see it's really wide and also what's interesting as we can see one shot one second of fire with a 50 deep penetration and sustained fire until we've gone all the way through 200 blocks and as you can see you can see the three stages there from the same weapon so yeah draw your own conclusions guys that's the whole point of these tests so i hope you enjoyed this video please come back again soon and see more and hit that subscribe button if uh, you did enjoy see you soon